seven months and 25,000 miles ago, we had a question. How do we make sure that the kids are able to experience life the way we did growing up? How are we going to make sure they have those holidays and those traditions? And how do they make friends? And that question really made us uncertain if this was the right lifestyle for us. Well, after that seven months and 25,000 miles, we can confirm that it was a good choice. The kids are able to experience the holidays and traditions that we normally have, but in a new way. You know, we're making new traditions, making new memories, and they're making friends all over the country. And although their friends, for the most part, are someone we see occasionally once every month or two, we also have the friends that we run into almost every other week. So for me, for Katie, for the kids, I think this was the perfect choice for our family. And if you've had those questions too, if you're considering this lifestyle, whether it's right for you, I can tell you that there's a million ways that it can be done, but we were able to keep that feeling of holiday spirits alive and well, and the kids have been able to make friends just like they could at home. So this lifestyle isn't hindering, it doesn't take away from the joy or the fun. I think it adds to it. I think with this lifestyle, you're able to do a lot more. You have a lot more freedom to experience life. If you check out the clips that follow, you'll see what I mean. We just got to the Chesapeake Bay RV Resort uh, in Virginia, and it is amazing. The amenities are awesome. I think the kids are gonna have a lot of fun. Unfortunately, the pools are closed, but there is still a lot of activities. Um, the weekend is full of all sorts of activities for the kids. So we're going to enjoy uh, a slow week of hanging out at the, the park, not going off on any crazy adventures, but I think it's going to be uh, it's going to be much needed relaxation. We're going to our store trading. Yeah? I'm sore. You're sore? Um, <laughs> and I <laughs> You're welcome. My dad has to hold her hat down. Thank you. Today is move day from our time here at Chesapeake Bay RV Resort. We have had an amazing time here. Beautiful resort, lots of amenities. The kids have had an absolute blast. But I think Monroe, tell us a little bit more. It was awesome. It was awesome? Mm -hmm. What was your favorite thing? Probably playing with my friend Nikki. Playing with your friend Nikki. Mm -hmm. Did you enjoy trick-or-treating? Yes. What was your favorite thing to do at the park besides play with Nikki? Was it the chess, the mini golf? Probably chess winning against Elena. Playing chess against Elena? And, I, and me winning. And you winning. We, uh, we had trick-or-treating here. There is a lot of amenities. Um, really good events for the kids. There was a dance. Uh, it's been really fun. We made new friends. Uh, that's always the goal. Make friends, both the kids and the adults. Uh, try and meet as many people as we can and, and share our story and, and hear theirs. Uh, overall, I think this has been a very enjoyable place to be and I'm hopeful that we can come back. Just you.
So not only are we here on YouTube, but we're also on TikTok, Facebook, and Instagram. If you click the link down below, follow to our Instagram, you'll be able to see what we did with these jack-o'-lanterns. If you already follow us on our Instagram, you already know. It was fun. Trick or treat! Trick or treat! Are you guys excited? Yeah! yeah. All right, trick or treating. Do you run, walk, crawl, Whatever you feel yeah. comfortable with. Run. That's what that's what the correct answer is. It's running. You're okay. Nothing scares a witch. Nothing scares a witch. Not even the dragon. 